temperatures around Colorado right now, not too bad. We're in the 30s and 40s on the eastern plains. A few places have dipped to the 20s, like Lamar 51 in Trinidad right now. That lets you know it's a little windy down there. 20s and 30s in the high country, 43 over in Grand Junction. Ken Namath, he's out north of Sterling and uh, on the northeastern plains. He's at 23. A little bit warmer at Joy's house. She's out south of Bennett in central Arapahoe County, 45 degrees. Uh, it's windy on the south and east side of Metro Denver, also on I-70 west of town. The wind's spilling out from the southwest. We're going to see the wind speeds really tick up as we go through time. They're strong in uh, eastern Utah right now, and a lot of that wind will be making, <clears throat> excuse me, its way across Colorado. It's because of a storm system. The low is passing to our north, too far away to do anything significant for us in terms of precipitation, but it does drag a cold front through the state as we go through time uh, today, tonight, and into early tomorrow when the wind is really going to crank behind it. Northwest Colorado, you do stand the chance to see a decent shot of snow. You're closer to the low pressure system. Uh, nothing significant. The reason the advisory has been issued is because with the wind, we may see some travel troubles with that wind and snow. On the eastern plains, it's fire danger every Everybody along and east of the foothills, a red flag warning through sunset. Winds today could gust to 50. We may see some uh, fires break out, unfortunately, like we did yesterday. We have to really watch that closely. Snow moves into the northwest mountains by mid-afternoon. Uh, southwest Colorado, you may get a few snow showers, but it will be on the light side. Maybe a quick sprinkle as the front rolls off the mountains and across the eastern plains today. But for the most part, it's a wind story with a cool down on the way. And a quick shot of snow for the northwestern mountains will keep a little snow into early Monday, and then it will start to fade away as well. Wind picks up today. Tomorrow it gets even stronger. Gusts may hit 60. We have a warning in effect on the eastern plains and a high wind watch for Denver. Also a fire weather watch for tomorrow. If tomorrow's trash day, I would wait to put that trash out. Don't do it overnight tonight because it may blow away. That's how strong the winds will be. 60s and low 70s east, 30s and 40s up high, 50s out west. Five day forecast looks like this, Joel. Big cool down for tomorrow with winds up to 60. We will call this a Bora, B-O-R-A. That means cold air coming in on very strong northwest winds. It's a chilly start to the week with a lot of wind on the way.